Serious, respectful question. Why did you have a problem with Lindsay Shepard being criticized for being non-critical, but you criticized Faith Goldie for being non-critical? Well, the fundamental issue, I really listened carefully to Faith's interview, the, the interview that was conducted, I think, with the Daily Stormer. I really listened to it, and I sat down and listened to it with my son, whose judgment I respect a lot. And... The thing that differentiates the two is that Faith is a journalist. And my sense was that in the situation that she found herself, it was incumbent on her as a journalist to ask at least one or two probing questions, given the nature of the people, the known nature and the fact that she knew the nature of the people that she was talking to. And I don't feel that she did it. And you know, I was obviously not alone in my assessment of that. So her employer, who was very favorably predisposed towards her, also let her go as a consequence of that. And so I know that, and I've been accused of being hypocritical as a consequence. And I should also say that the decision to restructure the panel wasn't mine alone. Um, it was actually, well, it was divided up amongst the panel members, essentially. But that's what we decided that's what we decided and you know faith herself had offered to bow out of the panel uh, because she knew that her presence would be con controversial in a way that might not be productive so whereas lindsay was just a student you know and and she was doing what she was supposed to do now i'm not trying to denigrate faith as a journalist in it some general sense but you know Charlottesville was very touchy and and it was and it required an unbelievably deft hand to go into that sort of rat's nest and come out unscathed. And, you know, maybe we should think kudos for her to her for having the courage to even attempt it. But there's a difference between it's not that easy to distinguish between brave and foolhardy. And you know what they say? Well, Anyways, like I said, we thought about it a lot. I listened to it a lot. We made the decision we made. I'm not trying to say that, you know, it was right in some omniscient sense, but I don't think that the situation that Lindsay Shepard found herself in is sufficiently comparable to that of faith to make the question, to make the comparison fundamentally valid. So.